Hi, Kim Adams here, founder of Happy Healthy Groovy and Feminine Confidence and Lifestyle Coach. I'm just recording this quick video today as a way of just talking a little bit about the idea of confidence. I talk a lot about confidence and there's a lot of stuff on social media at the moment talking about women and empowering women and having confidence. And so what, is, what does having confidence mean and why is it so important and why are we talking about it so much now? And I think part of the reason is that for a lot of professional women, there is a real difference between the confidence that they have in the workplace and the confidence they have in their personal life and the confidence that they have on the inside. And for me, I know what that was like when I was in my professional career before I started working for myself, there was almost like there was a mask that I wore when I went to work. It was the mask of being very much in charge, being outwardly confident, knowing what I was talking about and projecting that in the workplace in a way that made people listen to me and respect my ideas and direction. But on the inside there was just so much anxiety and self-doubt about myself and who I was and my self value. And I see a lot of my clients in the same way is that if you were to talk to them, you would see someone who was very outspoken and forthright and confident. And yet when they start to open up and talk about what they're really feeling, what they're really feeling is a lot of, am I good enough? Am I worthy enough? I Do I have the body that I can be proud of? Do I feel good about who I am? And a sense that there's almost like they're hiding the true self behind this mask that they present to the world and that it's become such a habit that they start to lose really what is that sense of, of who they really are. And once we start to move into our late 30s and our 40s, it starts to be something that comes up as a question of, I feel almost disconnected from what I'm presenting to the world and who I really am, but I'm not really sure who I am anymore and where my value sits because I've created this whole professional life that sets, situates my value in what I do and say in the workplace that doesn't really correlate with who I feel on the inside. So to me, confidence is about really gaining that sense of knowing who you are and knowing what your authentic and true self is and allowing that to shine wherever you are and feeling that confidence is not about feeling better than anyone else it's not about even feeling that you are the best but it's about knowing that you are the best you that you are and that you're unique and it's okay to show those qualities and I think the best thing about being confident in yourself is that when you are exuding that self-confidence and you can sit comfortably in who you are and present that wherever you are with whoever you're with, you give other people permission to be themselves. So your confidence in yourself allows other people to be their true selves. And I found this in the workplace when I started to really let a little bit more of the true me out just before I left my position. And it's funny how I didn't start to do that until I knew that I would be leaving. And so I started to just be me and allow more of my quirky, somewhat slightly hippie side out at work and talking about mind body stuff with um, a lot of male bosses that I thought would just never get that. And they actually loved it. They wanted to talk about it. They, they were thinking a lot of these things or they were secretly almost you know, in their personal life looking at this whole mind body spirit connection and were really open to talking about things like chakras and energy. I was totally um, surprised. I'd not spoken about that at work because I thought that would be laughed at and scoffed at in the business that I was in. But by me being myself and allowing my inner self to come out, it allowed them to talk about what they actually thought and believed as well. So I think that's the most important thing about being confident. It gives other people permission to be confident, to be themselves. Till next week, have a great week. Bye.